Janet Lopez with Circle Four Properties and Keller Williams Realty. I am here today in the beautiful subdivision of Bella Oaks, which is located in Toller, Texas. And I am here today with Malcolm and Taylor Canute of Key Waden Homes. And uh, we're going to chat with these guys a little bit about, about this beautiful home. Thank you guys for coming in today. Thank you very much for taking the time to come visit us and tour our home. You bet. First of all, when I walked into the home, I loved all the natural light that is provided in this home. So what I want to know from you guys is what goes into your thought process when, when constructing a home, you know, such as the lighting or any of your signature personal touches? Well, one of the first places that we always start is figuring out how to get as much natural light into as many of the rooms in the home as possible. Windows are expensive, but natural light when properly distributed will make the rooms feel larger ceilings higher it's uh, it's an effort to bring the outside inside that really I think creates a, an atmosphere that uh, uh, is just more welcoming right I agree we also use in the window category um, top of the line manufacturers most of the homes in our subdivision here are either Pella windows or Anderson windows, uh, which are both um, on the higher end. And depending on what's available and lead times, we usually try to stick with both of those companies. That's great, you guys. So moving on, um, I just I noticed all the beam inside the beams work. You know, all the beams that you have, even under these porches. So talk to me about that a little bit. Is that a signature? thing that you guys do or well like they're not just there to add character which they definitely do mm -hmm. uh, and help create the elevated ceilings but they're actually structural so what mm -hmm. you're looking at is not some sort of a facade it's I it's see. the actual structure that's holding up the, the house the both choice. on the okay. exactly on the inside mm -hmm. and on the outside okay and like I said and it does add a lot of character oh, it's beautiful it's beautiful it's a distinguishing factor for sure. Well, thank you. And we, we build them all on site as well. We okay. have the steel plates uh, that you see on the inside fabricated mm -hmm. specifically for the homes uh, right. that are being built. Um, and like I said, it just adds a, a twist that, uh, I don't want to keep using the word character, but you combine the fact that it's structural with mm -hmm. the, the look it creates. And uh, I think right. it just it sets us apart a little bit. Oh, I love it. And then let's move on to the kitchen. Tell me about the countertops, the appliances, and, and what you guys offer uh, as far as that goes. We definitely uh, splurge a little bit when it comes to appliances. Um, we're a big believer that we sell a complete home. And when you come in, we include everything from the refrigerator to the washer and dryer to the dishwasher. So when you purchase a key weight in home, you just have to move your furniture in and um, we like to use higher end appliances. This home in particular has all KitchenAid appliances. Mm -hmm. uh, similar to Windows, we don't use just one brand, but almost everything is professional grade, whether it's GE, awesome. Monogram, Cafe, or in this case, KitchenAid. Okay, okay. So you brought up KeyWay. That is your trademark name. Tell us about the name KeyWay. Well, it's kind of came about it's a couple of things that all um, kind of fit in for us we uh, I grew up spending a lot of time down in southern Florida uh, in the Naples Marco Island area and there's a island there that we used to visit all the time called Key Wade, uh, Key Wade Island and when we moved down here we were coming up with uh, a name for our company after we started it and thought it was kind of outside the box so we went with that and then also Key Wade has another meaning it also means coming home um, from the song of Hiawatha so it all kind of worked out uh, yeah. perfectly that you know our company Key Wade and Homes Key Wade and Developments um, you know when you buy a Key Wade home you're, you're coming home yeah that is perfect I love that that's excellent um, what was the inspiration on this particular home I, I kind of see a southwest Kind of a feel and then of course I've been living in Oregon for the last 20 some years and I see a little bit of a bend uh, feel to it too so what was the inspiration for you guys on this particular home 
Well, uh, when we first moved here from Chicago, we got hooked up with a architect that is uh, based out of Heiko, Texas, which is okay. a small little town about 30 miles from here. And it's considered on the very northern edge of the hill country. Mm -hmm. And um, we like to, we like to uh, think that this home epitomizes the type of home you see in, in the hill country. Okay. A lot of natural stone, natural timbers and cedar. Um, it, uh, it was designed the first time we built it by my wife and I based uh, on our lifestyle moving here from Chicago. It was just going to be the two of us. So it's got a big open feel to it on in the central part of the house and then the master bedroom and bathroom um, definitely it, you can tell it's set up for uh, you know yeah, for a couple, and then we have two other bedrooms that are on the complete other side of the house. Mm -hmm. So if we have family or friends that are coming into town, they can retreat to a bedroom situation sure. be completely isolated. Sure. Yeah. Um, but we've used this actual design, the architectural elements and the look of it on a lot of our other homes. And uh, again, it's a look that uh, separates us a little bit from the our competition mm -hmm. and distinguishes us. Um, mm -hmm. It takes a little bit more thought and uh, right. effort to bring it all together, uh, but I think it's uh, helping us build a brand right. that people are starting to recognize. Right. I love the master bath, by the way. Okay. I have never seen that concept in all my years of real estate. It's uh, it's definitely it's that's kind of style with the the large shower with mm -hmm. the kind of open tub area that are all incorporated into one. We've, We've been doing that with several of our homes uh, in this subdivision and, and others, and it's, it is quite popular with, with buyers. Um, going along with the, the same uh, style of this home and other ones, we like to utilize, like we're talking about with windows, a lot of the natural light. Mm -hmm. We also like to incorporate large porches, both in the front and rear. This house in particular has a, a very large front porch and a sizable back porch, especially in these types of developments with two plus acre lots beautiful hardwood trees um, and the beautiful weather that we have here you want to be able to take advantage of the outside of the house as much as the inside absolutely so. absolutely well that's all I have for you guys today is there anything else that you would like to add that maybe I have forgotten to ask about um, and you Taylor pointed it out a few minutes ago mm -hmm. when we do build our homes uh, we we put a lot of thought on the front end so that the finished product is a finished product. Um, and like Taylor said, when you when you buy a Q8 home, you're buying a home that is 100% complete. So we match up towel bars and paper holders with mirrors in the bathrooms, with light fixtures and plumbing fixtures. And like Taylor said, right down to the appliances, we include the washer and dryer as right. well as a completely stocked kitchen mm -hmm. array of appliances. Um, and literally when you buy one of our homes, the only thing you really need to do is just move in exactly and enjoy love that yeah thank you so much for coming today i appreciate you guys and appreciate your time and we'll see you next time thank yeah, you very absolutely. much thank you. all right